Yep, this is the file on my phone. I can't change the head coat. Oops, I haven't switched it over to you. <laughs> uh, that's all right. It's fine. It's done. <laughs> Just waiting for the doors to finish doing their thing. I need tea, clearly. Can I say pannier? No. Oh yes, the title. This is Gleniet uh, to Port uh, Donok. Donok. Uh, Gleniet. It's by Rivanis. It is Craben, Craben, Craben Moore Branch, and it's the uh, Pannier Tank. If you haven't seen the Craben Moore Branch, I think I've only run it the once so far. So we're Gleniet, uh, which is uh, here, and we're going to go up the branch and back. Right away, driver, your first stop is Dakini. Looks like we have a road. Yeah, certainly, um, Haddock, just send, uh, remind me. Um, I think you should be able to send me a list of which assets it's looking for, and I'll send them over. We've got a green light. Let the thing coast while I figure out what the ideal fire mass is. Yeah, this is a pan uh, pannier that I'm driving. It's the one from Falmouth, as far as I can tell. Right, we're going to speed up now. Right, we found the ideal fire mass, and it's about sort of 64, 65. Is open. Right, 30 limit, dropping to 25 in a moment. I'll show you the map in a minute, 4072.
Feels like it's a bit far out. I'm feeling a bit exposed. <laughs> Oh, don't forget, folks, that there is a Halloween competition on over on train-simulator.com. There's some good entries coming in, but we want to see some more. So get your writing hats on. Go over to train-simulator.com. You can get a. Uh, you can find out the details, what the prizes are, and uh, and so forth. Um, and uh, yeah, take part. It's all good fun for Halloween. Squealing is a joy to behold. Yeah, the Super D should be out soon. I'm looking forward to running that one. Well, actually, I'm kind of, I kind of am, and I'm kind of not, because I've been listening to Ed, who's been describing his fun making the scenarios, and I think he specifically hates me. Actually, given that other people are going to run these as well, I think he just hates everybody. <laughs> Actually, they sound really good. Really, really good. He's not making it easy, I'll just say that. Next station, Craven Moor. Uh, Jason Norman, I've got everything on Steam, so uh, I can run anything you want to see. Um, and what I do is I plan streams in advance, so I can't take on a request, you know, immediately. Um, but I can certainly uh, look at um, requests um, upcoming. Uh, effectively, I mean, essentially, what I generally ask is that if there's a, a find a, if there's a particular train you want me to run, see if you can find a scenario about it on Workshop and say, hey, can you run this one? because um, it's easier if you can find a scenario you want to see um, that looks good and it's got the train and route that you want to see then I can um, uh, then I can download that and have a look I mean everything I've run tonight has been stuff that's been user requested or viewer requested Stoke up little and often Fuller's doing all right. So far, so good. Evening, Gouger. Welcome, sir. I've got a 220, not a 221. So I've got the cross country Voyager. I don't have the um, the Just Trains Virgin one, for example. Yeah, I've, sh I've opened the damper already, Ed. Craven Moore coming up.
cruising into Craven Moor, coming in reasonably well on time, slightly early. <clears throat> no, I don't have the class 142 because it's not on Steam. I've only got stuff that's on Steam. Assuming that's my signal connected to there. And that's a red. Is there something coming in? Yep, there is. 14XX coming the other way. Use the opportunity to uh, get some water thrown in. GWR, class 52. Good night, Ninja Joker. Right, proceed when ready, and the signal screen, obviously, that would be good. Guess I'm going to need to tab to get through that one, or is that somehow my signal? <laughs> hey, Trainmaster613, welcome to a stream again. It's all rooted for me. How long till it ends? Oh, quite a while. Four hour stream tonight. I don't know why. That's right. I did tab though, so don't you be giving me any rubbish. Twenty-five. Boiler pressure staying good so far. Jason Norman, yeah, I do know the train, so it's Penny Tank now, and then we're going to run the pooch after this.
We won't acknowledge the change of ends. That's bizarre. You're having a lot of trouble with that, Arnold. B. Harrison, of course you can make a suggestion. You can always make a suggestion. Moggy, no, you can't make a suggestion. You're not allowed to anymore. Not after that last suggestion. That was that was outrageous. Oh yeah, there's no reason why you can't make um, just normal assets out of tunnels, absolutely. Some people have already done that actually, I think that might be how the U-Bahn works. Hey MC6443, you're on the tea and biscuits now, Strat Shadow. There's nothing for it, I'm going to have to join you in a cup of tea. Are we all going to have a cup of tea now? Is it official stream tea time? driver see you later 613 Almost trolled by a tree. It's not uncommon to have grass growing in the middle of tracks that are on branch lines and things. I haven't really got the money to start throwing weed killer down it every five minutes. Six four four three. You're gonna fill up your kettle for a cuppa. Good man. Uh, baked bean kid. What about Mardi? Don't forget Mardi. Let's 
sign down for 25 limit just here. You rarely have ever play it. it. Must be I don't I don't run it as much as I like, but I really enjoy it when I do run it. Just getting that that thirty wagon challenge is just awesome. Absolutely, Amarillo, and I can do that. Or you could clone the route, Amarillo, and um, add some assets in from an older route. Like Riviera line. Calbracan, I believe, is the other end. No, Port Donock is the other end of the line. Made a scenario with random stop stack pipe. I'm interested in seeing. Is that how you put that on workshop? That sounds interesting. Back on your laptops, Francois. Superb. We have a green. Get Alice sitting to Calbracken Ferry. All right, thanks, B. Harrison. I'll look at the uh, my all my whispers after the stream. Oh, it's easy to spad, is it? Oh, all right. <laughs> Plenty of time. Oh, sorry to hear that heavy lift. Coal lashes in your eye at the DNS. That's not good. I hope you're all well and your eyesight is recovering. <clears throat> where is... Um, I don't know where this is set, Francois, if I'm going to be completely honest with you. Maybe someone can have a look on, for Craven Moor Branch on the... Uh, um, on workshop and see. Hi, mug of water. A tea bag. We have the makings for tea. 
Right away, proceed to Port Dornock. Right, 25 as we pull out. A fictional 30 mile branch line set in the Highlands of Scotland during the 50s and 60s. There you go, thank you, Stephen Jam. Bit of a rise coming up now. One in sixty eight grade. One seventy. It's easing up slowly. Sell out a model trains 160. Twenty five limit. You got mini cheddars. I do all my snacking after the stream. Upon arrival at Port Donock, make sure you have enough space to clear the junction to loop round the other end. Hey there, Dan Demand, welcome sir, welcome. Slow down to the 15, and then that brings us into Port Donock. Um, our signal is green. See you later, Enderman. Have a good day at school. Uh, what did you get? 6443 for a gaming keyboard.
Andrew Rennie, this is Craven Moor Branch. It's a workshop room. Rather, rather lovely one, actually. Plenty of room for a run-round manoeuvre. Gonna give it a run round. It's official. Right now, our next instructions are to drop the coaches, move forward to the head shunt, go back via the loop, and then couple back up to the uh, train, and then we do a run back to Glen Eight. Burns fingers. T, cheers to you all. Oh, crack it. That hit spot. That hit spot, lad. Make sure you clear the junction before uncoupling. I am. Stop panicking. Let's pin the brakes on. Move forward to the head shot. Cobra K739. Who makes the Cobra? Or is Cobra the people who make it? Get right into there to get to the head shunt. James Junction. Are we now done? Nope, that one already was right. That one was wrong. Shall we check the loop? Right, we're okay to come all the way out. See you later, Dave. Approved. We've already tabbed that. Oh, nice safety for sure, Jason Norman. Thank you. Brakes on. And the route has already switched to bring us back in.
Hey Chris 512. Nice little area here. Oh, what's wrong with silage, B. Harrison? Have they have they um, nerfed it? Right, let's make sure doors are on, uh, brakes are on. Good, got some brakes on so we're secure. Open the doors. I'll release the handbrakes now. Put it in reverse. Probably could have pushed it down a little bit more. <laughs> Everything is more work in FS17. Yeah, I figured that much. But that's fine. I mean, you're not playing the game to just have it say, Congratulations, you've won. Switch the lights over. That's it. We've got a white on. A white on the back now. Some bell ringers need shooting. I quite like that actually. Makes the place feel a bit alive. Right away, driver. Proceed when ready. Thank you for the T5029, much appreciated sir. Yeah, the new scroll remote looks good. Not as cosy as if it was a Twitch Plays pannier, David. That would be really cosy. Struggling up the 1 in 73 at the moment, but we'll get there. We're still due in to Calbrook and Ferry a little bit early. I 
See you later, Chris. up a bit. Twenty five limit up ahead, not much point speeding. A T I I wouldn't want to know what a private investigator would be then. Cracking route, isn't it, Francois? It really is good. I've run it once before on stream, if my memory serves. With a 2MT, if I remember rightly. Hey there, he is 64, welcome. Slowing down for the 25. The shoot in the saddle tank, not a bad shout, B. Harrison. This has got steam gala or uh, you know preserve railway gala written all over it, hasn't it? K. Wally, 2014. This is indeed very, very live. Welcome to the stream. Stop at Calbrook and Ferry. Calbrook and Ferry? Ferry. I can't speak! Right. So, centre here. Okay, I shall tab through that then with the looks of it. Amazing Harry, welcome. Good to see you. Can I give an overview of what the whole HUD controls for the steam engine do? So essentially this puts water in um, on the right. The left hand one puts... Um, coal in. Um, this is your boiler pressure with the red circle or green circle depending on red if it's going down, green if it's going up. 
The idea isn't specifically to keep it green, but to, the green is just the red. The red and green is just to tell you very quickly if it's going down or up, this, like this is going up. Uh, similarly, the vacuum brake gauge here, uh, if it says 21 or 25, generally that means the brakes are released. If it says zero, they're on completely. Uh, and by moving the brake gauge up and down, you make that go up and down. So when I release the brakes in a minute, I'll show you. In fact, I can try it now. If I push up a little bit, you see it starts going down, put it back to self-lapped or running, it stops. So that's essentially the brakes have gone down a bit further on and stopped. Yeah, there's a whole technique for how you man use the manually lapped. I've got how to drive steam train tutorial, uh, which goes into a lot of detail on all this stuff. Right away. Control tab, danger approved. You put it back into the lap setting once you've released the brakes. So at the moment, these ones are 25. Um, once you've, uh, I did control tab that, don't panic. Yeah, once you've released the brakes and you don't want to move anymore, always put them back into self lapped or running state. Twenty five limit at the moment. You can't find yourself on the Excel document. Which Excel document are you looking on? There are two. There's one where Excel document though is where the suggestions go into. That should just be immediate. I'm not even in control of that. You, you first submit the form, it appears on there. There's another one which is the sorted list that Francois maintains. And that's manually copied across as and when he gets time. Just, he tries to do as often as possible. So you just wait a day or two and hopefully it'll be done. How do you cancel the DSD? If you press Control D and Control F, it switches off all of the cab tr cab signalling. One of them, uh, I think, the one that's marked ACSES does the alerter. Tarbridge is next. Bridge scraping face off hype. Yeah, the Amtrak ACS sixty four, amazing Harry. Control D and Control F toggle it. If you look actually on the control desk, there's a thing which says whether or not they've been um, locked out, and you can see the little LEDs. You press Control D and Control if you can see the lights changing. 1 in 57 Can someone point official Jace Norman at a link to the um, the, sp uh, the different spreadsheets so that he can make sure his suggestions have been added?
coming off the grade now, 1 in 81. Gouger, keep up the streams, Matt. Sorry, not always around to see it, but not a problem at all, mate. Thank you very, very much. Can I get some GGs for the Gouger? See what I did there? Yeah, yeah no, 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 fine. Fair enough. <laughs> Thank you very much, mate. Whoa, there, baby. Whoa. Seriously, whoa. As it stopped. Thank you. I thought that said SNT. I was about to say, holy moly. Scotland by Sunday night trucking. <laughs> Almost never worth. That wasn't almost never worth. Any Ralph fan scenarios lined up? No, I don't actually. I need to sort that out. Alright, Craven Moore. Actually, we'll put that on. Um, Mad Matt, can you email the website? I think it's train simulator at dovetailgames.com um, and email them a screenshot of the error message that you're getting and then they can try and help you out. Email them a copy of your, RT or your entry as well. Oops, no, not minus four. Don't be silly. I've never heard of sandbox strategies, Rubku. I know transport fever, but I don't know about transport strategies. That's cool. If you're getting a key, let us know how it is. That pedal's not fine enough. <laughs> Those of you that have seen my G933 unboxing videos, is there anything else that you think I should be doing with the unboxing videos? Are they fine as they are? Is there any, any suggestions for improvement? Anything else you'd like to see? Anything you think I'd go on, about, on and on a bit about too much and you'd like me to just, you know, get on with it? Um... Any feedback you've got on the unboxings, I really appreciate. Oh, 
screen. Hey, Tyron One, welcome, sir. Unbox a cuckoo clock. <laughs> That was a cockerel, is that close enough? In the video next time I opened, well, I opened a pack of tea live on stream. You may not have seen it however, but I did. I opened a pack of tea live on stream. It was epic, I tell you what, it was absolutely epic. Unbox the CH throttle quadrant. I don't need to, mate. It all works fine, thanks. <laughs> Unbox a small box. You lot are full of useful help, uh, useful help aren't you? <laughs> now just say thanks. Change the format and have a boxing to send stuff up to send to mock pack boxing things up to send them to Moggy. See that would be an unusual one, wouldn't it? Ooh, hello. Something must be coming in. Here he comes, auto coach. Unbox TSW. <laughs> I don't need to, it works fine, thanks. <laughs> Thinking outside the unbox, that's what that's what I'm looking for, homebound train. Thinking outside the unboxing. Boxing some boxes with some boxing gloves. What about boxing some boxing gloves in a box? With a box. Wait a moment for the auto coach train to return. Moggy is doing an unboxing of his Minecraft Super Gold Edition. Yeah, we're all looking forward to that Strat Shadow. That would be epic. That's that that stream will break the internet. It would all have to take place in box tunnel, absolutely. Just think, that means that every day trains are unboxing all the time. Coming out of box tunnel. We do an unboxing video. <laughs> unboxing day in box tunnel. Unboxing a beautiful lady. <laughs> My wife might have something to say about that. <laughs> Hello, Mr. Auto Coach 14XX. Can I go yet? Yeah. 
looks like I've got the road. It just hasn't told me. Right, we requested permission to proceed. Even though the signal said so, we're actually we're the ones lined up to go. Well, we're in boxer shorts. <laughs> Lesson learned, don't ask the viewers for their input. <laughs> uh, Del Kinley isn't the last stop, no. We've got Del Kinley and then Glen Inn. So we're nearly there. Twitch Prime is part of Amazon Prime. So Twitch Prime is not free at uh, Ronak because Amazon Prime isn't free. It, it is one of the benefits you get for paying for Amazon Prime. Fox in the box, that sounds more like Dr. Zeus does trains. You're enjoying the demo for your truck, are you, Tyron One? Yeah, wait for a um a sale and pick you can pick it up at a good really good price probably. It's um it's Euro Truck is really good. And we certainly were pro mods. Uh, with pro mods, you get even more gameplay out of it. All right, there's Dal Kinley. Hey there, King Superbolt. Welcome to the stream. Have you followed the advice on Stim Squirrel's website about getting Rust Map and Pro Mods to work together? You just got to get the load order right, and it all just works. So it's so it looks like anyway. I've not tried it yet. I don't know official Jason Norman. Send me a Twitch message about your details and I will have a look myself and if I can't find them then I'll let you know. But if you filled in the web form they will be there at the bottom.
Right, this is Doc Kinley. It's a lovely route, isn't it, Strat Shadow? Right, Glen 8. Signal's off. Alright, proceeding up to 30 miles now, then we'll get 40, 1.39 miles to our final stop. We're currently aiming to be just about around on time. Right, the other analogy you could use is, when you go into Tesco's, when you pay them money, they give you free milk. Or not. Try and leave the loco in a good state for the next driver. Good fire, good coal, good water, sorry. Slowing down for 25. That's really odd, kickback man. What's wrong with the map, Yorkshire Girl Gamer? Uh, because this is a fictional route, so it's probably done over the, um, over the equator at zero, zero, zero. The map obviously only works on real routes, because the map is the real world. SPM Cooper Minecraft stream was um, Haddock. Kickback Man, can you try taking a video of what you can see and then share the video to people? Maybe because if the video looks okay to other people, you know it's your monitor, but if the video looks blocky to other people, then it's what's coming in, if you see what I mean.
little top up of the water. Sorry, we're in Scotland. A wee top up of the water. No, that was horrible. I apologise. A wee top up. That wasn't quite so bad. Right. Uh, what about getting the video to one of the moderators or one of the people on the stream and see whether or not the, how it looks to them? Because if it's a local problem on the way that your computer is showing things, it won't show up on the video. Whereas if it's what's coming in or how it's drawing it, then it will show up on the video. I don't know if that makes any sense. Excellent driver. The ride went smooth as predicted and the passengers are talking positively about the branch line. You deserve a break. And maybe a cup of tea. Right, that was fantastic. Really good job there. Great scenario, great route. Excellent. Right, okay, last one. <laughs>